Recently, I asked each member of our TGS Men's Breakfast group to write or record a message to be shared with their friends, telling them of the most important things they would like them to study and learn once they have gone. A bit like a last will and testament. And they only have three minutes or two sides of an A4 sheet of paper. Now my time has come to go to Pakistan on a mission and I've been warned not to go due to the danger. Barclays Bank have refused to give me insurance cover because of the high risks involved. So I'm going to give my three minute talk to you all now. I would wish people to know that I came to believe in God and was converted from crime to Christ as told in my book, Converted on LSD Trip. I would like them to know that God exists and has communicated with mankind, and a record of this is the Bible. That God can be known in and through the person of the Lord Jesus Christ, this being to point them directly to God in person, who is the one to help them. Also, that I experience what the Bible talks about as salvation, that is from sin, death, and hell. That all my sins have been forgiven, and that I have the gift of imputed righteousness. That I would like them to know that the Bible contains a record of the creation of the world along with the purposes of God for our existence. I would wish them to know that once they come to a knowledge of who Jesus is and believe in him as the Son of God, that they should go on to learn the Christian teaching concerning his death and resurrection. I would then like them to go on to learn why the Bible is classified as the Word of God. Then, to recall the story of the fall or sin of Adam and Eve in the garden in terms of its effects upon the human race, and to recall the first promise of a deliverer made to Adam and Eve in the garden styled the seed of the woman. Then state the reason for God destroying the old world by a flood and saving Noah and his family. To recall the story of God's call of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob and Israel going down into Egypt. Recount the story of their bondage and deliverance from Egypt by Moses. To tell the story of the giving of the law by Moses and its function. And then state what the apostles had to say about the law of Moses and its fulfilment. After that, I would like them to find out and state for themselves how we came by the Old Testament scriptures. And when the New Testament scriptures were written, how we came by our Bible in the English tongue, and how can we be certain we have copies of the originals, and why the Protestant Reformation took place and its significance, and then what are the essential differences between the Roman Catholic Church and a Protestant Church, and then summarise in their own words the message of the Gospel.